Hi guys, this is a tutorial on how to do the poor man's morphing. I saw other tutorials online and the only ones that I seen was for fine for motion four. Um, one was in German and for motion five and then there hasn't been any. And it's very simple. You have to um sequence your photos as to how this looks like. Let me see if I can break it down. You have to break it down into 0001 and then 002. So you can sequence it in. So it can come out like this as a unify um, image. What you do is you import it. Select it and import it. And then once imported, you go into your inspector. From inspector you go to properties. And from properties over here, show timing. Then from the frame blending mode, you go into optical flow. And then you hit optical flow, it will process the image. Which will take a little bit of a while. And once it's processed, Once it's processed, the speed we put it to zero point seven zero. I mean, let me see. Zero point seven. Click that, and it'll extend the timing on the timeline. And it should be working this way. And that's just the way you do it. Um, I don't know if you can make it more longer. Maybe zero point four and it will go much slower and I see if you put I mean the timing on the timeline Zero point three. Let's put zero point three, and yeah, it will go beyond the timeline. And once that's done, you can just render it. You can just sequence a whole bunch of images. and make the timeline much more stretched out so it can go slower. And that's how you do your time, um, your morphing or poor man's morphing with optical flow and motion. Have a good one, take care, bye.